This is chapter 6 using Oracle Virtual Private Database to control database access. Part 2. Part 1 already we completed row level. Now we see column masking. What is the column masking? How we do the column masking? We study in the this particular thing, the column level policies. That is our major one. The column level, controlling this day in the column level, policy enforce row level security when a query reference a security relevant column. That is called SCK and uh, S E C I F underscore R E L relevant column. You can apply column level Oracle virtual private database policy to table view, but not synonyms. But row level possible for synonyms. So, to apply the policy to column, specify the security relevant column by using SCC underscore relevant underscore call parameter of the where DBMS underscore RLS row level security in this packet dot add policy procedure you include this parameter this parameter apply the security policy whenever column is referenced explicitly or implicitly in a query the oracle private uh, virtual private database policy with sales department user cannot see the salary of outside the department maybe some other department for admin or research whatever it will be you cannot able to see it will hide it will give the null value of the sales department user. So, the relevant column of the policy are sale and common uh, commission. First, the Oracle Private Database Policy function is created and then added by using it. As we were saying, like uh, here, how we did the function is created, then policy is added. Only thing difference is the same way the policy extra parameter will come. SEC underscore relevant underscore column. One more parameter will be how this is parameter. The same way, one more parameter will be added. That's all. The column level. This is called column masking. It will mask. So, the default behavior of column level Oracle private virtual uh, virtual private database to restrict the number of rows returned for a query. Same like row level. Uh, reference column contains sensitive information. So, we can use the parameter here. So, this is called column masking. This column masking is given all row display. So, here also we can give one. All row, DVMS all row means it will display all row, it never restrict. That is also one of the, the parameter called opt, optional. OPT, if you give, it will give all. So we can give the all. So the sensitive column display the null values, the enable column masking only display. So the column masking return all rows requested by sales user, but return with one, null value, but it won't show. That is a thing. What are the conditions applied for column masking? Column masking apply only select statement. We use uh, insert, update, delete and all there in row level. Here you see statement type. Statement type we use what? We use select, insert, update, whatever it may be. We use lot of insert. Here you but in column masking we can use only for select statement. That is the only thing. Column masking contain generated by policy function must be simple boolean expression. True or false. So that is what the function must be simple boolean. Whatever it may be regular provision. For application that perform calculation or do not expect null value, use standard column level virtual private database specify relevant column rather than opt column of so, Do not include column of the object data type, including XML type also. Column must be used with update as select. Updates only the column the user are allowed to see. From some queries, column masking may prevent some rows for displaying, for example, sale is equal to sale. The column masking option was set. The query may not return rows if the salary column return a null value. So now we can go and see what is called the column masking here. Here I will show the column level masking. Here you see how many rows are coming. Suppose here my spot schema. I have M table. I am selecting the people. I am selecting the number of. So what I will do is here you can see. The value sales salesman is one job, clerk is one job, manager is one job, resident is one job, analyst one job. So different department, accounting, research, sales. So three departments are available. Accounting department, research department, sales department is available. Salary or commission. But commission generally coming where whom? Commission is coming, very few salesmen, sales department. Other department there is no commission, but salary is there. So you can see this is actual case. 
this is actual table of M table. Now we can go, we can see in the department table how many departments? Four departments are there. Research operation. But in the actual table there is no operation. I won't take that one. Create or replace function hide. This is I think one part of the table. It is not full table, complete table. Not complete table. It is a part of the table. So our function hide column. This is a function I am creating. Return where care as. We already know one parameter should be schema, another parameter should be what? Table. Already we know that. Begin department number is equal to 30. Department number 30 means what actually? Here you can see 30 means sales department. How many records? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6 records are sales department. Now I can go return on. That's what I am giving here. So we know already this return should be where car to everything end function created. What is function name? Function name is hide underscore sale underscore commission. Now we want to create what? Policy. So now I can use policy. Object schema is called. The schema is called. Table name is M. Policy name this is. This is function name. Hide sale column is a policy name. Which actually schema we create this is. Which column we are making null. We are making hide. Sales and commission. Now procedure created. You can see here. Now 14 rows selected. This way I can select 14 rows are coming actually. So 14 rows selected. Now I can include. Before doing any policy, which schema you are using here? Which schema you are using the policy? You should be what? This account status of the schema should be what? Open. That is very important. So it should be open. If it is not open, we already know. We make what? Alt account like OE. Previously we did know. Unlock. Account lock, uh, password expired, whatever it may be. We can did here what? Account unlock. We did account unlock. You see here? Account unlock. This way I make open. Otherwise, if it's already open, no problem. If it is not there, make account unlock. That is very easy. Now, what I will do is, I will open start tiger. I will check how many rows are coming. Six. Why other rows are not coming? Only six rows. You can see here, six rows only have the sales and Sales department. The department is equal to sales. It is restricting the table. Only sales department. Not showing another 14 rows. It is giving how many rows? Only 6 rows. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. This rows are. This is what the policy hiding column is doing the platform. So it will show what are the. It will have the sales and sales. Suppose. Here what I am using. Select relevant columns. Only relevant columns. Column 1. Suppose. I will give. Opt option. We already studied. Select relevant opt option. All rows. I want all 14 rows to see. But I don't want to see. If I give this option, what will happen is all row will highlight. All row will display. There is no doubt. But the salary and uh, commission column is easy. You go and see. The salary, if I give that one and username, you can see salary becomes what? Null value. Commission becomes what? Null value. Already commission is not here. As per our thing, there is no commission. You see here, there is no commission at all here. There is any commission? No. There is no commission in accounting. Reasons. But salary is there. 2450 for club. King 5000 is there. But if you see this all, the king president 5000 salary is not there. What is the thing is, what is the difference? It will show all rows, but it will hide. It will hide. It makes null value for other people's salary. Only sales people, I can see. Because why it is doing like this? Why it is showing this? As my condition is what here? In the where condition, whatever it may be. I given condition, department number is equal to 30. The department number only, I can see. I am a sales manager. I can see only my employee sales and column. Other department sales, I can't even see. So which column it makes null? Why it makes sales and commission only null? Why it is not doing? Other column null is, I am giving restriction, make this column only null, that's all. Otherwise, if I make this also, this also become null. So, I am very clear, I am giving this column to this column. Also. That's why, sales and other columns, sales and commission column only become what? Null. That I specifically mentioned in the select 11 column sales and commission. Yeah. So, here all rows means so If I am not showing what will happen, only 6. So this is the difference between how to use DBMS, all rows and then this is the 
column level masking, column masking using virtual private database in Oracle.